Not only have I been harvesting them all game, I let one of them die, so... It's kind of disappointing. Alright, come on, little sister number two, let's go. That's gonna be your name. I'm just gonna name you after which one you are in the line of little sisters. We got little sister two, little sister harder right here. Where are you even going over here? Oh my god. Well, this isn't good. This is very not good. I was not ready for this. You know, I'm not even gonna use the crossbow. Uh, what should I use? You're gonna have to, like, run somewhere. Oh man, my robot's dead now. Whatever. Why don't you go get your own little sister, damn it? This one's mine. He destroyed my robot, or I destroyed it in the crossfire. Who knows what happened? Better with you than alone. Alone in the crawling dark depths. What do you think's in this wall? Can I even go over here? I guess there's... There's some stuff over here. Nothing too crazy, but some stuff's better than no stuff. I agree. I agree fully. Is this fire gonna go away? Maybe I should just walk around it. Oh, I was about to say, she's just hauling ass out of here. Alright, well, I should probably check out some of these shops and stuff. Yeah, they give you, like, a bunch of ammo here, too. Really a fair bit of stuff. Oh, I bought, I bought a little bit too much, but whatever. Well, I guess I'll just get these slots, I mean. <laughs> why the hell else not? There's that. There's that last one. And that should be the last one there, too. Maxed all tracks, look at that, I got a trophy. Got a nice trophy for that. Not bad. Hell, I don't even care what ended up in those slots. Take the av oh wait, where's this tool? Oh here it is. What are you waiting for? Fontaine wakes above. There will be no going back from here. Make sure you are ready to face him before we be lost. Damn, they give you so much stuff here. Just tons of ammo and stuff for you to have. It's pretty nice. Problem is, is I've been like maxed out on ammo for the longest time. Alright, let me go ahead and take all that. Make sure I'm all maxed out here. Welcome to the circus of Seems like we're good. I don't know what he's even gonna be. Is he is he gonna be in like armor or something? I'm not sure. I don't remember the fight. Whatever. Let's uh let's save before I do this. Just in case. Oh, wait. Could not save progress because there's not enough space remaining in application save data. Please, de please delete application save data in order to create more saves. All right. Well, I probably don't need some of these saves from, like, September 19th, huh? Could not... Okay. Well, I guess I should, uh... I guess, I guess I'll just delete some more. I'm gonna have to clear out my hard drive a little bit. I mean, I downloaded Mafia Three and and something else I think recently, um, because I'm pretty much about to play Mafia Three tonight because it finally comes out. But I don't know if that's clogging up my hard drive or I just have too many fucking saves to begin with. Something's clogging up my hard drive. I'm gonna have to clear some of it out here soon. 
But anyway, we got we got a nice save here. Let's get the hell out of here. Trying to create a new save is like the final boss of the game. Try just trying to get enough space on the hard drive is the final battle. Can you do it? Can you create enough save space? If you can't, you better hope your power doesn't go out, otherwise you're fucked. I probably wouldn't have to go back that far anyway. There's probably like decent autosaves somewhere. I remember when me and the crowd put you in that sub. You were no more than two. You were my ace in the hole. But you were also the closest thing I ever had to a son. And that's why this hurts. Betrayal, kid. Life ain't strictly business. Oh well, here we get a save anyway. Could not save progress because... <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Are you joking me? They not even let me save any- they won't even let me save in here. I don't even get that autosave. I guess I'm just fucked. Whatever. I made that save, like, right before we got up here, though, so... Oh, God, I definitely don't remember how to do this. Drain Adam of Fontaine. Go or is, Jesus. <laughs> I'm so backwards today. Drain Fontaine of Adam, let's see. Oh, here we go. I'm so backwards today. Hmm, I wonder if electricity would be okay. I don't know if anti-personnel anti rounds would work on them. I'm not sure if armor piercing would be good for him. He seems like he's kind of beefy, so... Maybe he just has a ton of health, who knows. Need a minute. Then I'm gonna cut you to Drain him again a little bit. So I guess he just pretty much needs to deplete, deplete his health over and over again. Oh god, is there like a bot a bot shutdown somewhere? I'm not sure. You think it'll be that easy? Come again. Uh, is that a bot shutdown? I don't think so. What is this? Apparently nothing. I was hoping maybe there'd be like a bot shutdown, but... Oh, he's icy now. He's like super icy. I was hoping he'd come over here so I could get him in the oil. There we go. Should work out a little bit better. Oh, Ow. Alright, what do I got? I got armor piercing rounds. Think that would do anything on him? Probably not. And it'll do... It'll do like a super amount of damage, but whatever, I guess dance damage. I think we'd be good against them. Proximity mines? He runs around a little bit, so... Come on, dash through him. His dash doesn't set these off? Are you joking? What? I guess his dash doesn't set them off. That's pretty weird. I figured it would, but... I guess he just gets to dash through it. Oh, what the hell? Oh god, now there's just now there's just like shitty regular enemies. Oh, these explosions completely fucking over. Catch my breath. All right, this should be the last of his Adam. There should not be much more here. I had you built. I sent you topside. 
I called you back, showed you what you was, what you was capable of. Even that life you thought you had, that was something I dreamed up and I tattooed inside your head. Now, if you don't call that family, I don't know what it is. And now. Alright, well, I, I guess the little sisters are gonna help me out even though I've been harvesting them all game. Yeah, whatever. I mean, that's pretty nice of them, right? Yeah, drain him, drain him. Stab him over and over, damn it. Fuck this guy, yeah, keep stabbing him. What a sack of shit that guy is. Yeah, but it's awfully nice of them to lend a hand when I've just been harvesting them all game, so. They offered you everything, yes. And in return, you gave them what I have come to expect of you. Brutality. Oh, I'm gonna harvest her again. I can't stop doing it, apparently. You took what you wanted. All the Adam, all the power. Oh man, a bunch of splices got out. Rapture trembled, but in the end, even the Rapture was not enough for you. Your father was terrified the world would try to steal the secrets of his city, but not you. For now, you have stolen the terrible secrets of the world. Man, this is like one hell of a bad. Oh my god, that ending was awful. I'm pretty sure that wasn't the original ending I got back when I played like forever ago I think I think there was a much nicer ending to get then again it has been you know a good little bit since I have played the game and whatnot but that's gonna be it for Bioshock Bioshock is not a new game so I probably really don't need to talk about it too much I'm sure most of you have already played Bioshock if you thought it was or heard it was a good game since it's been out since like 2007 or 2008 or some shit it's been out for a while and uh, you know, people loved it back when it came out. I'm sure people still love it, so... I'm sure a lot of people have already played this game. When it comes to the to the new, I guess, uh, HD remaster package thing that they have, where you get Bioshock 1, Bioshock 2, and Bioshock Infinite, it's 60 bucks, so... I don't know. If you haven't played it before and you want to play it on... I guess what would be a current gen console now. It's not really that. Is it still next gen? I don't know if it's next gen anymore. But if you want to play it on like PS4 or, or Xbox One and uh, you haven't played it before, it's probably a decent pickup for 60 bucks. I'm sure you can get the other games altogether cheaper, especially if you have Steam or something. I think you might have gotten this for free on Steam if you already owned them. If you already owned some of, if not all of the past games. Um, I think they might have just given you the the HD remaster for free. I'm not exactly sure. Don't quote me on that. I might be wrong. But I, I'm pretty sure I remember someone saying something about that. But who knows? But, yeah, I mean, if you're just on console and you're, and you're looking to play these two or three games, or at least Bioshock... If you're only looking to play Bioshock 1, it's probably not really worth, you know, spending 60 bucks. I'm not sure how much the game looks better than the original, but at least it seems like it runs at a pretty solid... 60 FPS, if not close to that, most of the time. It feels pretty smooth, so that's nice. There really aren't a whole lot of uh, frame problems throughout the game, which you would kind of expect that. Um, Bioshock is like an 8 or a 9 year old game now anyway. It's it's at least 7 years old, I would say. 2009 might have been like the latest year it came out. I can't remember what year it came out, but... I mean, I would sure hope that a game that came out on, like, the 360 and the PS3 could run at a little bit better of a frame rate on an, an Xbox One or a PS4. Then again, I'm, I'm not sure exactly what the frame rate was, was in the original game. It could have been 60, but I don't, I don't know. I have no idea. It was probably 30. 30 is usually a safe bet, but some games I'm pretty sure did run at 60, so who the hell knows, but... Uh, I don't know. Depends if, uh, if you're looking to pick up the whole package and you don't care. Maybe you're looking to jump back into it. It's probably not a bad deal. It's pretty much like 20 bucks per game. So it's not terrible. I haven't played the other two. I haven't played the other two in this remaster. 
I have played the other two before this, and I'm pretty sure both of those were recorded and put up on the channel, you know, whenever they came out, whenever Bioshock 2 came out, probably forever ago, and uh, when Infinite came out in the past couple years. But I guess that's really all I got to say. I mean, I'm sure most people who are interested in this either picked it up or not. I don't know how I feel about remasters. There's a lot of remasters coming out for, like, every game. And I know it's kind of funny that I say that because I just beat the Bioshock remaster and I'm currently playing the COD 4 remaster, but it seriously seems like a lot of games are getting remasters. Just like every game is getting a port or a remaster that's coming out on current gen consoles now, so I'm probably going to pick and choose them a little bit better. I mean, don't, don't quote me on that. I don't even know if I talked about this in the first part. I meant to talk about it, but it doesn't even matter. But don't quote I me. Mean, it's not like I'm saying, you know, all the HD remasters are stupid. Why are they doing it? And I'm not saying that I'm not going to play any of them. I mean, who knows? I might be. I might play like six in a row if I'm really interested. Because I was kind of interested in doing Bioshock again. Which, obviously, if you made it this far, or maybe you're just checking out the last video for some reason. I did it, and I beat the game. But... Uh, and I'm also doing the COD 4 remaster, but there's also like a Batman remaster coming out. It was supposed to come out in the summer. I had actually kind of planned to do it, but then it got delayed, so I don't know what's going to happen with it. I'm probably not going to, I don't know. People ask me to do Batman games here and there, especially Arkham Knight, because I'm pretty sure that's the one that I didn't record. So maybe one day I'll do, you know, maybe some Batman stuff, or I'll do some more remasters, but there are an awful lot of games getting remasters at this point. And I probably won't be continuously doing them over and over and over again. I mean, maybe if there's nothing going on, it really wouldn't matter. And even if I wasn't super interested in it, it'd still be something to do, but... I mean, there's always plenty of stuff I can probably go back and do that maybe I haven't done a, uh, a playthrough of, a recorded playthrough of. Or maybe it was just a game that uh, I didn't uh, record for one reason or another. So who knows, but that's Bioshock. I had fun with it. Game's fun, as usual. I expected it to be fun, because I, I like the original, and they would have to try pretty hard to fuck it up. The port would have to be absolutely terrible. Then again, there have been there have been some HD remasters or HD ports that w weren't really that good. I know a lot of people didn't like the Silent Hill 2 and 3 HD remaster that came out back in, like, I don't know, 2012 or 2013. It was, it was, it's been a couple years since that came out. That was kind of a meh port. Um, so I guess, I mean, I guess they could have messed it up, but so far it looks pretty good. Seems to play pretty well. But, uh, that's gonna be it for me and Bioshock. So I hope you enjoyed the playthrough. Sorry it took a little bit longer to get this done than I intended. Getting sick for that, like, one week really, uh, didn't help, so. At least it's done now. I have to move on to other stuff because October is... We're finally starting to get some some more consistent new releases and like three of them came out all around the same day or the same week. I don't think any of them came out on the same day, but... It was, it was the COD 4 remaster, it's Mafia 3 tonight, and then Gears 4 on like Tuesday. After, you know, weeks and weeks of rather inconsistent releases. And then when there were releases, I wasn't really picking up the game anyway. So... There were, uh, there were a couple games that I ended up skipping because I didn't look... I didn't think I would be too interested in them. And uh, the games that I pretty much have skipped, I'm pretty glad that I really didn't start them. Because I don't know how well that would have gone. But that's going to be it for me. Um, Bioshock 2. I know I talked a little bit about maybe recording Bioshock 2 um, towards the middle of the playthrough. I don't remember when I was talking about it. In the beginning, I said don't really expect it. And then towards the middle of the playthrough, I would say, as time went on, I was like, oh, this is really fun. I might do Bioshock 2. Unfortunately, that's probably not going to happen now because I got sick. And uh, it's going to get harder to, to juggle games as easily because new stuff is coming out. And I usually like to prioritize new stuff coming out as opposed to older stuff that might have been sitting around for a little bit. Or maybe, you know, games I've already done a playthrough on, especially like Bioshock 2. I'm, I'm like 99% sure I've done a playthrough on that game. It might be a little bit older, but definitely pretty sure I did a playthrough on it. Who knows? But I probably won't be uh, recording Bioshock 2 now, so uh, I'm sorry if I got anyone's hopes up. I don't really know if there were a ton of people that were excited for it. And Bioshock 2, I, I didn't like Bioshock 2 as much as the original. I don't exactly remember why, but I'm sure if I played it again, I might realize it. But for now, probably doesn't look like I'm going to be doing Bioshock 2, so 
other than that, that's pretty much, I guess, a little bit of bad news to end on. It's kind of sucky, but other than that, the game's done. Thank you for joining me for the playthrough. Uh, I'm done talking about irrelevant stuff. Usually, I always go on random tangents at the end or the beginning of playthroughs, and I end up talking for, like, 30 minutes for no reason, but that's going to be it for now. I hope you enjoyed the playthrough, and I'll see you guys for whatever other game you decide to check out. Terrifying.